everybody, welcome back to the channel. We're up here at James County tonight. We're going to the mud race. Uh, I brought my teal truck to run some super stock, and my dad brought his truck. He's running street stock and possibly hot stock with it. Uh, looking forward to a good night of racing. Should be some fast rides here. It'll make for a really good video. If you aren't already, subscribe to the channel, and thank you all for watching.
45 with an 8 for Casey. Seven seventy four with a two. Four twenty nine with a two. Four twenty nine with a two for Ryan. That's a wrap on the James County Mud Race. Uh, big thanks to KOI Drag Race for putting on the event. Uh, there was eleven trucks in the Super Stock class, which was probably one of the biggest as far as turnouts I've ever seen in Super Stock. So pretty pleased with that. Uh, we ended up placing fifth. Uh, the first pass I ended up going around, it was my fastest pass of the night. There's a dryer center run, so I decided to try those. Uh, it hopped on me in the rear end, as you saw in the initial takeoff of my first pass. and But I kept the truck nice and straight and ended up making my fastest pass of the night. The second pass, I came around and it was a little stickier part of the track. I was hoping to bring it up higher on the trans brake and we wouldn't hop. Well, it took care of that problem and we were able to bring it up a little bit higher but it and it did not hop but i ended up coming out of the rut about halfway down the track and it fishtailed me a little bit and ended up making a slower time slip so unfortunately that didn't pan out for me but still placing fifth that's really good for us um the truck just keeps coming around and we're going to keep making changes and try and keep going faster with it uh, my dad he ran street stock class and he was able to pull out the win on it uh, he ran his first pass was set the fast time for the class and he sat on the bubble for us to race so Really glad for that. I left my blazer at home. I didn't feel there was any point in running it too, and I wanted to just keep tinkering on this track and we're gonna just keep trying to get it as fast as we possibly can, so. But overall, we had a really successful night and pretty happy with the outcome. Well, we ended up deciding to skip Saturday night and we were planning on Bullock County, but didn't quite make it there. Uh, we had hay on the ground and trying to get it all wrapped up before Sunday. Just didn't happen. I ended up taking Sunday and I worked on this truck some, 
end up getting the rear glass back in it, painted the cage on it. Uh, of course, uh, you might have noticed in the video it has a bed cover on it now. I have a few other things I'm planning on doing with the truck. I'll probably end up making a video on that, so be on the lookout for it. This week, there's a lot of rain in the forecast, but I'm hoping maybe we can get to do some racing. Uh, there's a race in Salem, Indiana. It's their fair race. If we don't get rained out, I'm planning to go to it. It's on Thursday night, but we're just going to have to see whether they're permitting. And then Rising Sun, same deal. It's on Friday night. It's a dirt drag, and it's just going to completely depend what the weather does. There's significant chances of rain, which we can't complain about because it's gotten really, really dry here in southern Indiana. So... I'm happy to see some rain, but it does put a little damn thing on our race schedule. But that's the plan for the week. If it doesn't rain, we're just going to have to play it by ear and what we can do, what we can do. But I appreciate y'all watching the video. If you aren't already, subscribe to the channel and we'll see you in the next one.